Hi. So this video is going to be exciting. As you guys will know a little bit more about me, um, I'm excited to get to your questions. Now I have a list here of the questions that I chose to answer and what I feel comfortable with. So let's get started. Are you ready? Great. So, first question, how old am I? Um, I'm 22, and I just turned 22 last month. As you guys saw my birthday video, I did ask you guys in that video to guess my age, and a lot of you guys got it right. I'm 22. So that's great. You guys are really smart. Um, and do you have a Snapchat? No, I don't. But I will consider it because it is very popular. How long have you been doing YouTube for? If you look at my one year video, that will answer your question. One year. And the most um, question that you guys all been wondering, and I've gotten so many questions, majority of the questions were just that question, or they were all the same question, and um, it is, when am I going to show my face? Um, the reason I don't show my face at this time is just for my privacy. Um, um, yeah, it's because I, I do, um, have things that I go to for my things, like, bigger things that I want in life. Like, as you guys will know in the question, my dreams and goals, there is meetings, and when I do get auditions or meetings, and I go in, I just don't have to worry about anything because... That's how I want it right now. I want it like this so I can get my work done during the day, no problems, and um, go to my meetings and do what I need to do that are important and business decisions and then things that I want for my life and then that's for now. But um, in the future, we'll see how you guys will see all of this. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so, next question, why do I do ASMR? I do it to relax, you guys. I do it to make sure you're relaxed at night, you, I cure your problems. I do get a lot of messages from fans telling me that I've helped them with insomnia or they had, you know, health problems and I've relaxed them or they do homework and my voice relaxes them. So I really appreciate all those letters. That means the world to me that I can help you and relax you and kind of relieve your problems because that's what I'm here for. And also to entertain you, but to relax you, because that's what we want. Relax. Next question. Will you ever do a twerk video? Now, I can twerk, but um, <laughs> um, I uh, maybe I'll do it when I hit a million for you guys. I'll do a nice one on here, but... Um, Maybe when I hit a million, I'll do that for you guys. So that could be my promise, maybe. So one million subscribers, and I'll do a twerk video. And you guys could pick the outfit and the song, or, yeah, we could do something like that. Um, yeah. What are your plans? Oh, are you, and are you planning on doing any other role plays than the ones you have done? Yes, I have a lot of role plays for you guys coming up. 
I actually ordered my doctor outfit and all the doctor accessories with it, so I'm still waiting for those to come. And I do have a list of role plays I'm doing for you guys, because I love when I get to like act and do all that for you guys. And um, yeah, so a lot of role plays are coming up, so. Next question, what are your plans for your channel in the future? Um, I just want to make this channel to be the greatest ever, and um, I just, just as it keeps going, I just want it to be the best, and um, yeah, and always put out great content. If you could go back and relive any moment, which would it be and what would you do differently? Um, I would re relive my childhood. I had a great childhood. Um, it was really nice, and uh, I, as I think back now, I had the little cute mermaid doll, and the little Snow White, and Cinderella, and just really smooth, no worries. Um, and uh, if I could do something differently about it, I would probably go back and not be so hyper. I was very hyper as a child. Um, I just was really outgoing and uh, too, you know, outgoing for the class. <laughs> but um, I just, just love to like play and have fun. And, but I love school, but I was just really hyper. So I would go back and uh, change that and be more calm and, you know, yeah. Um, what are the top four things you love most about men? Um, I love, if I'm attracted to a guy, I would want him to have a great smile. Um, like, you know, make me laugh. Uh, be good to me. And, um, I love when they're handsome. <laughs> and, um, they're know, professional, um, nice smile, nice personality, and, uh, just a nice person. More videos with Persian food, please. <laughs> I can definitely, um, put that on my list to incorporate that in a video for you guys. I know Persian food is good, so I can actually get, like, get some, like, kab kab kebabs, <laughs> and, um, I know English, like, in English they say kebab, but Farsi is kebab, so I should do a video on that. It's really good. How do you make your skin look so smooth? Um, it's just genetics. Is this falling down? I got this today and it just it looks so great at the fitting room. Usually I don't try my stuff. I usually know my size, buy it and go, but this one for some reason I wanted to try it, but it doesn't stay up. It slips off. Um, yeah, so it's just genetics and um, also eating healthy keeps it going. Um, what's your favorite holiday? It's Christmas. I love Christmas. It's a beautiful holiday. I feel like everybody's so sweet in Christmas. Every grocery store, every, just everybody's so nice at Christmas and sweet. It's a, you know, a family time, a loving environment, and it's nice. Why aren't you active on Twitter? I actually just posted a tweet the other day saying that I was going to um, be more active on there, to post more with updates, so you guys can go check out my Twitter. The link to my Twitter is down below in the description on my channel. And yeah, I should start posting on there because you guys like the updates during the day. They're like quick little tweets and you would know what's going on. But um, 
What's your favorite food? I don't really have a favorite food. Um, I just, I love a lot of food, but I don't have a favorite food. Like, I can't just pick one, but I can tell you some of the things I like. I like sushi. No, I don't like sushi, actually. I love sushi. But, um, sushi in a way is, the sushi I eat is a vegetarian sushi. I don't eat raw sushi at this time. It might change a couple years from now, but, you know, when you get older, things change. Like, I might want to eat that or try that, but I'm not interested in that now. The sushis I love, like when I go to a sushi restaurant, I get vegetarian sushi, which has um, seaweed around it, and it's the rice under the seaweed, and has carrots, cucumber, has like, um, forgot the green leaf herb in there, and has avocado, and then I also love the cucumber and avocado roll. I just love all the vegetarian ones. They're really good. And, um, yeah. Oh, and I like, um, I love pizza, but I don't eat it all the time. Just when I want to celebrate, I love pizza. Um, yeah, I like good food. Who could say that? Favorite food is good food. Um, favorite quotes. Um, I, I have so many quotes that I love. And I've seen a lot of quotes, quotes on Instagram. And there's like a, a page where they have all these life quotes about success and wealth and dr dreams and following and everything. Um, I love that. I, I don't remember the name of the page, but I love all like life quotes that are true. I should have had some to kind of like tell you guys, but... Um, yeah, just things that like, you know, live your life and uh, do what you want to do, what you feel in your heart you love. Don't worry about nobody else. Don't let no one stop you. Um, I like patience as a virtue. Um, good things come to those who wait. Um, all these like really nice quotes because they're all true. Um, what's your ethnicity? I am Persian. Um... So, yeah, in person. And I was born in Cali, raised in Cali. But, um, yeah. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is pink and red. So, like, light blue, like the ocean. So, yeah. Mm, what products do you use for your curly hair? Um, for now, I don't use any products. I just have a natural, come out of the shower and just let it dry and voila. <laughs> yeah. So, um, how do you keep, I had a lot of questions, how do you keep such a trim, healthy body with all the delicious food and snacks you eat in your videos? How much do you work out and what healthier foods do you suggest? Also, would you ever, <laughs> also will you ever bring back any more popsicle videos. Okay, so, um, I keep a healthy body and slim or trim. Just, I don't eat a lot. I just, my body can't handle too much food. Like, I love food. Like, I go to the store and I'll look at everything. All the chips, all the candies, like candies, like gummies and stuff, and look at them, and I just dream. I don't buy them. I just look at them and say, oh, they're just like every package, they're good and stuff, but I don't buy them because I know it's, I can't eat that. It's not, like, good for me, but it's so good. I just look at it and dream, but it doesn't go anywhere near this, but, um, yeah, and I just eat healthy. I love salads. Um, I don't eat um, too much bread. Um, I don't eat too much, like, you know, carbs and stuff. I just really like light foods, and it's what I can handle. And um, 
because I'm always active so I can't like if I eat like a whole meal I probably like sit like a potato and I can't move I'm like need to have my light foods and I love like ice cream tea or lots of water and then if I really need to like be up all day all night have coffee but I do believe though that one time a week do a cheat day you can buy whatever you want, eat whatever you want for that one day. But my problem is, if I do that, then I want it every day. So I try not to do that, but, oh my god, because once you put it in you, you're like, oh, I want it again, I'll be okay, just give me more. So I try not to do that, because I, I can say I love food, but, yeah, and, um, what healthier foods do you suggest? Um, oh, and also you guys asked uh, with all the delicious food and snacks I eat in my videos. Um, the food that I eat for you guys in my videos, I don't consume it on a daily basis. It is like the Taco Bell or pizza or something I do fun for you guys. I don't eat it every day. I do it to make you guys like happy and you guys can kind of enjoy and see things that I like when I want to have fun and eat. So. Like Taco Bell's really good. I can go to Taco Bell every day, but it's just so good. Um, but yeah, and what healthier foods do I suggest? Um, I suggest just healthy foods like eat your vegetables, your salads, drink lots of water. Um, uh, you could have ice cream tea. Just water is the best for your body. Um, and um, healthy foods, I you can have your protein like a piece of steak or a grilled lean piece of chicken, you know, once in a while. You need that protein, gives you energy. Um, but you know, have your vegetables. Don't eat s too much snacks or too many sweets and stuff like that. Like, I mean, they're good, but you know, these are my tips. Um, also, we ever bring back any more popsicle videos? I would love to, but, but um, yeah, they were some fun times, some good times those days. What are three things you simply cannot live without? My phone, laptop, and water. Yeah, I can't live without those three things. Oh, and you guys asked if I work out. Um, what type of exercise do I do? I do work out every day. Um, I work out in my house. Um, yeah, I do cardio. And uh, just like jump up and down. And um, <laughs> yeah, just like get that heart beating. And um, yeah, and it boosts your mood too. So. Yeah, and um... Do you, you like kebabs? Yes, I do. I love kebabs. How do you feel about Comedy Shorts Gamer reacting to your video? I feel great. Um, he enjoyed it. And, uh, yeah. Do you have any advice? Oh, yeah, it's the same question. Do you have any advice for skincare or advice for good eating habits? You just always look so beautiful and fit. Well, thank you. Um, uh, good eating habits, just eat healthy. And uh, skincare, it's genetics, but I do recommend using, um, you know, good uh, soap. I use Neutrogena. Always have. It's the best soap. And also, um, I, uh, every time... I take a shower, I change my sheets, new towel, everything has to be new. I don't go back on the sheets that I left to go take a shower with. It has to be a new sheet again, like a set of sheets again. Um, like clean sheets. Because you're taking a shower and you're cleaning up and you're refreshing. You don't want to go back on those same, you know, sheets again. How I've been doing it for my life. So, um, what's your favorite Starbucks drink? 
My favorite Starbucks drink is, I love the gingerbread frappuccino during the holidays. Ah, oh, that is my favorite drink and it comes with the cinnamon whipped cream. Yeah, so good. Um, but right now there, I love their um, espresso frappuccino. I love their ice cream tea. Um, yeah, they were really good drinks. What is your favorite bra by Victoria's Secret? I have a lot of bras from them and um, I love their darling push-up bras. Um, I love the ones with the diamond design. Mm, yeah, and uh, I have a red one I really like with the like diamonds on it. It's really nice and a wedding one, part of the I Do collection wedding collection from Victoria's Secret. It's white and it's so pretty. How big is your lingerie collection? It's very big. Um, I love lingerie. That's just my problem. I have a lot of lingerie but no clothes. So when I go out, that's why I have to go and uh, do some shopping because I need some clothes. I don't have any clothes. It's all lingerie. Pizza or hamburger? Pizza. I love pizza. Next question. Is Hungry Lips a part-time hobby or a full-time job? I would say Hungry Lips is kind of like my double life. Now, I love being sexy. But when it comes to my work, like during the day, I am a business girl and I get things done. I send emails, I work on, you know, future endeavors and business and all this stuff for my life further ahead. Um, but, and just pursue what I truly love and have always wanted. But when it's nighttime, I get ready and shoot. Um, Hungry Lips is who I am though. I love being sexy and dressing up, having fun. I'm just naturally sexy, but my mind is all work and achieving my goals. So during the day, it's all business. So that's why at night, yeah. <laughs> um, what got you motivated in the first place to start with your videos? Um, I wanted to do something on the side while I'm pursuing my dreams and goals. Where did you first learn? I know you guys, as I'm saying this, they're like, what is it? I'll get to what it is. So, Where did you learn first about ASMR? It just popped up on my phone on YouTube. It was interesting. I thought it was very interesting. Why doesn't your Instagram work? Work. Um, my Instagram is back up and running, working, and uh, as of uh, yesterday. So, uh, yeah. So I'm excited about that because I have a lot of nice photos for you guys to check out. So if you want to see that, the link is in the description down below for my Instagram. And, um, yeah, I always post cute photos on there. Did you ever end up finding a dining room table? <laughs> I did. I did. Um, but, uh, <sighs> just have to, yeah. Next question. Do you experience ASMR tingles myself? I do. What kind of music do you prefer? Um, I really like, just like every girl my age, unless they like something different, but I like um, just R&B, pop, you know, everything that's on the radio now, like um, 97.1, you know, that good music and uh, all the new music now, I love. Um, what's the most expensive thing a subscriber has gifted to you? You are all a gift to me. I am blessed to have each and every one of you there supporting me. It means so much to me, so thank you. Um, 
Are you into fashion? If so, what are your favorite stores? I am into fashion. I love fashion. My favorite stores are Forever 21, Nordstrom, and Victoria's Secret. Um, I occasionally, like once in a while, I go and check out Wet Seal just to see if they have anything. Um, but it's not my favorite store and it's not somewhere um, for my taste. I really like Forever 21. The designs are beautiful. The quality is good. Um, you know, like, I have, like, leggings from them, and it's just lasted so long, and, um, it's just, I love the patterns and the way they design their clothing. It's just really nice, and Nordstrom is just number one. Beautiful clothes, top quality, and Victoria's Secret, I love for my lingeries and bras because I think that's, they have the most sexiest things, and, um, they're just number one when it comes to all that stuff. What are your favorite ASMR triggers? My favorite ASMR triggers are, like if I want to relax, um, I like sometimes hair brushing, sometimes when they talk, when they type, when they think they're at a hotel, um, they tap, sometimes tapping, but mostly I like when they have like a soft voice or it's just, yeah, relaxing. Um, this question goes, how you doing? I'm doing good, thank you. How are you? What countries have you traveled to? Um, nowhere yet, but I hope to travel all around the world someday. What are your life goals? My life goals are to achieve all my dreams. If you would have been anybody for one day, who would it be and why? I wouldn't want to be anyone else. What is your go-to breakfast? My go-to breakfast is, I do believe that breakfast is the most important meal of the day because it is the first meal of the day and you're starting out your whole day right is when you first pick your breakfast in the morning. If it's healthy, then you're gonna go that whole day saying, you know, healthy because you started good in the first part of the day. Um, my go-to breakfast, I really, like if I'm going to like something important in the morning or something, I really like to go to Starbucks and get um, coffee, iced coffee, and a bacon gouda sandwich, artisan bacon. I love that, and that's what I can have just for my breakfast. That's my go-to, and then, you know, be good for, like, till lunchtime. But, um, yeah, that's, or, um, other than Starbucks, I like parfait fruits, um, just, I love berries, orange juice, just a healthy breakfast. Um, what do you like doing besides YouTube is achieving my dreams and, you know, what I want to do. I'm focused on that every day, pursuing that, so that's what I love. Is when I achieve that. Um, where do you live? In LA. I'm gonna say LA because my everything's there, my work's there, and my next place is there. So, what is your eye color? What is your favorite movie? I don't have a favorite movie, but I do like a lot of movies I've watched, but I can't pick one. If you won one million dollars, what's the first thing you would buy? I would probably invest it so 
I can make something big out of it. Do you yourself watch, listen to ASMR videos? If you do, what are your favorite triggers? Um, as I answered, um, hair brushing when they have a soft voice, sometimes when they type, and some role plays, but um, I, uh, I do watch ASMR videos sometimes when I'm trying to relax or if I'm in a mood where I want to think and like write an important email, I sometimes play them on in the background because it's relaxing me as I'm thinking. But not too relaxed, because then I'll fall asleep. <laughs> but, um, what inspired you to make your own channel and make ASMR videos? Um, just like I said, I wanted to, uh, you know, do something while I was pursuing my, uh, work. What is your favorite video ever made? Um, it's actually pinned on my channel. It's my ASMR kisses. Do you want to kiss? <laughs> I love that video. Are you getting your play button from YouTube? Yes. Who were you visiting back in winter? Um, I was visiting family. But that did not stop me from my work. This is my everything. I made a little design section for myself. I was like, I'm gonna have fun here, and I'm gonna, you know, fun during the day, eat, and it was during the holidays, but at night, I have to do my work, because if I don't film for a long time, I can go crazy. Like, I need to keep update with you guys, and, but I was like, at night, I gotta get ready, and action. But, um, yeah, I just, I couldn't be that long away so what's your favorite idea my favorite idea is being creative and I believe you can make something out of nothing um, and you could work your way from the bottom to the top just all about creativity and persistence and all that so have you ever thought on doing merch like shirts and stuff. I do have on my website um, for merchandise and I'm also having um, a designer design it in a little bit more of a nice like professional way and so I'm in the process of that and working on that but it is there for you to go look at. What do you see your, um, for yourself now? After this accomplishment, whether it's branching out in YouTube or focusing on other future endeavors, um, after this accomplishment, I just want to continue and um, I do want to branch out in YouTube and also focus on branching out, of course, outside of YouTube because that's what I've been focused on all the time, like before I started YouTube. My work is outside of YouTube, but now that I'm involved in all this, I include this into my, uh, my life, so branching out in it and, um, or focusing on future, it's all just all included, so, but yeah. Um, what are you going to do for 1 million subs? Um, like I said, that would be amazing. I would do a twerk video for you guys. Can I buy private videos? <laughs> yes, you can. All of that info is on my website, and you can also check out my Facebook. I have a lot of updates on there. And, uh, yeah, private video, audio, private photo, yeah. What TV shows are you in at the are you into at the moment? I don't really watch TV. I am so busy. I don't even have time. Um, I'm just, I haven't watched TV for a very, very long time. I know it sounds crazy, but I don't even have time. I'm just too busy with my work. Like my head is always into my work and 
my business and my life decisions and everything. I don't even have time for TV. Maybe when I'm, you know, settled one day, I can sit down and really relax and watch TV. But right now, too busy. Do you have any new updates on when you think you'll be getting a new mic? Okay, so I have to tell you guys. I ordered a mic about a week ago. It got here. I tried it out. I didn't like it. Um, I felt it sounded a little too harsh. Like, my voice sounded like just you can hear everything sound a little too harsh um, but I am thinking about getting maybe a mic I'm testing them out something soft that's really um, just not too harsh like you can hear the ev like the breathing and I don't know just something really nice so I'm still working on that who is your favorite ASMR artist I don't have a favorite ASMR artist I just um watch a couple people. I really like ASMR when they eat. <laughs> so when I'm hungry, I just sometimes like to watch that. What they eat, it's interesting. Um, what's your favorite part about creating ASMR content? Um, it's relaxing, you guys. Um, how do you deal with all the hate you get? Um, to tell you guys, there are going to be people that are going to tear you down, but you just have to be strong. They're going to want to bring you down, but you have to be strong and keep your head up and just keep moving forward. If it's something you truly love and work so hard for, don't let anyone get in your way or stop you from reaching where you want to be. You have to do what you feel is right and what you want to do. And don't let no one stop you. Next question. What's your favorite thing to do? <laughs> I have a great worth, eth worth ethic. Um, but besides doing that, I love to shop. Do you ever wear garter belts or stockings with your lingerie? Um, I can. In a private video just for you. Um, what's your favorite song at the moment? Um, I really like Too Good by Drake and Rihanna. I love Drake, so when he sings, it's all a hit. Could you do a Draw My Life video? Um, maybe if someone draws me and makes a video and kind of like sends it to me, or they know how to do it perfectly and they kind of put things together themselves and they're creative and send it to me I might upload it if I like it so if you have any ideas you can start that what was your favorite cartoon TV show growing up I loved Barney Barney was my favorite he made me so happy he was so cute oh would you why do you have really nice lips? Thank you. Um, it's genetics. What is your personal philosophy on how to be happy or successful in life? My philosophy is just do what you feel in your heart. Do what you love. Do what you want to do that makes you happy. Um, Leave and you should start your day the night before you should have your day scheduled um, if you want to be successful in life I really think you should have everything planned out organized scheduled um, I you know you could be happy by not taking s not serious things seriously um, just uh, focus on your own life, don't focus on the negativity, um, just focus on the positive and uh, do what you were born to do and um, yeah, and don't let no one stop you. 
What made you do videos like this, which are completely different to most other YouTubers? That question um, is a little interesting for me. Um, am I supposed to be the same as everyone else? I mean, if everyone copied one another and did the same thing, it wouldn't be unique. Like, I have my own talents and creativity, my own ideas. I am one of a kind. And I do me. That's just how it is. Top five songs. Um, right now, I really like Company by Justin Bieber. Um, Too Good by Drake. Um, like um, uh, Fetty Wap, uh, 679. <laughs> um, like a lot of songs right now, like Work from Fifth Harmony, um, just I like a lot of songs, um, I also have a Musical.ly account, so the link, um, not the link, the details are in the description down below if you guys want to check that out, I love music, so, um, I would love if you guys go check that out. Um, and if you want me in the future to upload them on here, like a whole video just of all the Musical.ly um, little clips, I can do that. But you guys should go check it out. I think you have to like you have to download the app and then type in official Hungry Lips and you can see all my little Musical.ly's. They're so cute and it's so fun, that app. I love it. Um, so you guys wanted to know my dreams and goals. Um, my dream is to become an actress, and, uh, so that's what I'm pursuing every day of my life. <laughs> I'm pursuing that, and I won't stop till I reach to the top, and, um, I just, every day I'm working on that, I submit for every you know, I like every day on top of it by trying to get my meetings and, you know, auditions and, um, you know, brand deals, just everything that's related to that. And also, um, I also love music and, um, I also am just pursuing that and, um, so like modeling, like commercials and print, um, and yeah, so I'm like already like in contact with, you know, labels and, you know, just working on it every day to make sure I get to where I want to be in life and build that path for myself and, um, I just... I just keep working till I get there and um, I just believe that you could do anything in this world if you put your mind to it and you put your all into it you can achieve it and you don't let no one get in your way you can do whatever you want in this world as long as you believe in yourself and, and um, yeah you can do it so yeah, that's what I love, and ever since I was a child, I always loved acting, and it's always what I wanted. Um, so, yeah, born in U.S. or Iran, and have you been back to visit, and Baladi Raza Irani Bepazi. Um, I was born in the U.S., and uh, I have never been to Iran, maybe one day I will visit. Um, and, uh, if I know how to cook Persian food, um, I know how to cook a lot of delicious foods. I cook really good, but, um, I don't know how to make Persian food yet, um, but I will soon. So, um, um, what is, does a day in your life look like? What does my day consist of is, um, just every day sending emails from morning um, just all day. I send emails, schedule things, um, just make sure I'm just, 
you know, keep working and working. Um, I love to work. Like, I can't sit in one place. I have to, like, get things done and um, just make sure that I get everything that I want to get. How did you solve your YouTube issues? If you guys go and watch my hi video, you will see I didn't give up. I emailed them every day till they answered me. It wasn't easy, but I got it done. It was not easy, but I knew how important this was to me and I got it done. Um, and yeah, so that is the end of the questions, Q&A that you guys have been all waiting for. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm so happy to have finally done this video for you guys and I really hope that you enjoyed it and uh, I will see you guys in the next video. The next video should be the doctor role play so stay tuned for that and um, I am so, yes, I'm so thankful for you guys so thank you so much for supporting me and um, if you have any, like, want to check any more updates and stuff, you can check out my Facebook, Instagram, my website. I have all the info on there for anything else. And, uh, yeah, so, um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.